So in this video we are going to talk about Fabric, a way of scaling PyTorch models without any boilerplate code. So imagine you really like the Lightning Trainer and all the features that it contains, for example mixed precision training and multi-GPU training. However, even though you like the Lightning Trainer, you don't really want to restructure your code using a Lightning module. In this case, you can use Fabric, which is a fast and lightweight way to scale PyTorch models without any boilerplate code. So how does it work? How can we use Fabric to scale our PyTorch code without making too many changes? So suppose we have the following plain PyTorch code here. So then we make a few small changes to bring advanced functionality without restructuring this. So here you can see in a nutshell what the slight modifications are, and really as you can see there are not that many. So let's walk through these step by step, converting our PyTorch code into Fabric. So first of all we have to import, instantiate and launch Fabric. Then as the second step we set up our model, the optimizer and the data loader. And then here as the last step, instead of calling loss.backward, we use fabric.backward.loss to compute the backward pass. And yeah, in a nutshell, that's all you have to do to change your PyTorch code to Fabric, and it will then allow you to use multiple GPUs, mixed precision training, and many other features of the trainer. So we will have a hands-on example in the next video, where I will show you how we can train a large language model using Fabric.